here's a real simple script formatting. I'm just gonna do it real fast. One, your font needs to be courier, new, size 12. Simple. Number two, anytime you have a new location, like you're starting like a new scene, you start with this, it's called a slug line, and you just have, it's all caps with single spaces, interior or exterior, if it's outside, okay? And actually this is outside, exterior, the Great Pyramid. You give the name of the location, it could be a room, it could be a place, and then you put the time of day with a space here, and then dash, and then day. Then you have your action. Any action that's being described, what we're seeing on the camera but no one's talking, is just like a regular, you just write. There's no indenting, there's no, uh, you don't, you know, you don't tab it in. You just write, write, write until you're done writing the description. And then as soon as there's talking, any talking that happens, you're gonna indent five times. This is just my technique. It's not the only way to do it. There's probably a more correct way, but I like it because it gets me close enough to an actual script format that I can sort of gauge how long my script is gonna take to film. So one, two, three, four, five. And then for dialogue, I tab it over one, two, three. And then when I get over here, I'm gonna scroll up so I can see this little, this little bar here. And if you don't see it, I believe you can turn it on under view, show ruler, okay? And that ruler will let you know when you hit to the about five and a half. If I had the word, so in this example, I had the word tonight. Okay, what's for dinner tonight? Okay, it's clearly over the five and a half mark. So I'm going to click in there and I'm going to hit enter, put it down to the next line, and, and then I'm going to hit period and I'm going to hit enter after that. Now, it auto capitalizes because it's on its own line. Just hit control Z one time and that gets back to normal. Then you should have only one space between these things. And I think you can show, can I show this? I don't know. Um, yeah, anyway, there's there's this little thing that lets you see like kind of where your spaces and your enters are, but I don't see where that is. So I'm not even gonna try to figure that out right now. So there you go, there's dialogue, there's your names. The names are always in all caps if it's the part of dialogue or the first time the name appears in the script, usually it's all caps. Um, and uh, there you go. There are the very basic uh, script formatting techniques to get you started using Google Docs writing a script. Hope that helps. Have a great day. Yada yada.